It's 7 a.m. and I'm up bright and early, showered and changed and ready for an interview on Energy FM. And this is the view out the window of my VIP suite. Yep, quick shot of the bathroom. Nice. The VIP suite of the Happy Tell in Dipolo. Happy Tell! Well, I'm in the quiet back streets of pretty much downtown Dipolo. And I think I've got to walk about maybe a kilometre to get to Energy FM. Radio station's what, on the fourth floor? Yes. <sighs> fourth floor. Uh, probably uh, a week. Just sitting in air-conditioned comfort, waiting for John Vincent to call me into the studio. Sir Marshall, uh, this is Champagne, our pretty DJ here. Hello Champagne. Do I sit here? Yes sir. Yeah. Right, yes, okay. Sir. Same sir. Yes, balik na mga pag-aoros ito pagbalik. Alas 8. 8 na sa Kabutago. Oo ba na ito mga pag-a, no? Ang uh, tuwa ang international vlogger na dugay-dugay nagpuni siya din na gablog din sa Tungasun sa Pilipinas. Si Sir Marshall Butters sa uh, Marshall Butters Vlogs. So, right now, atong ipalaila, sir. Can you please introduce yourself to the people who are listening right now? Yeah, hello everybody. My name is Marshall Butters. And I'm from Australia. And thank you, John, John Vincent, for having me on your show. Welcome, sir. It's, it's a pleasure. Yes, sir. What makes you come to the Polog that the Polog City will be one of the places that you featured in your blog? Well, there's a, there's a number of reasons why anyone would want to come to the Polog. Uh, one of them, of course, is the beautiful boulevard. Whoa. Uh, and also, people are very friendly. Whoa. It's, it's, it's a, a really nice place to just come and chill out. There's good restaurants, there, there's enough shopping. If you need anything, you can get whatever you want. How about the food? The, and the food's great. Yes, sir. Yeah, there's, there's quite, a, quite a few restaurants. There's quite a lot going on. Yes, sir. Uh, and it's, um, it's just a place that I find very relaxing. I've been here five times. Five times, wow. Yeah, so I came here for the Pagsalabok Festival. Pagsalabok Festival, yes, sir. Yeah. And uh, I made a video two nights ago mm -hmm. called uh, Dipolog by Night. Uh, yes, so it's been up for about 36 hours and it's already got 70,000 views. 70,000 views now. So it's doing really, really well. And that's good because the whole point is to promote Dipolog to the rest of the Philippines yes. and to the world. To the world. Yeah. Thank you, sir. And how about the peace and order situation that you observe here in Dipolo, sir? Well, well I don't see that there's any issue at all yes. in Dipolo. And yes, in fact, in most of Zamboanga mm -hmm. Peninsula, there's there's not really much of an issue. I think the, the red zone classification needs to be revisited by Australia, United States and um, Canada. Yes, sir. Uh, and, some, and it needs to be relaxed in certain areas and certainly Dipolo um, doesn't deserve to be anywhere near that. Yes, sir. Do you feel comfortable in staying here in our city, in the Pollock City, sir? Absolutely, yep. Oh. yeah. Try. And thank you, Energy FM, for having me on. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank Thanks. you so much, sir. Oh, that was a bit of fun. Now, it's time for a coffee. I went back to my hotel just for about an hour, but it's still only 10 a.m., but I'm starving. So, I've been going to this place here. And I've been having lunch or brunch here every day. They make a really good um, Bicol Express. And I try to get as many vegetables as I can. But the, I'm a little bit too early and they haven't got the chop suey yet. Oh, the chop suey's here. May I have Bicol Express and chop suey, please, with rice? Uh, the Bicol Express is over uh, there. Yeah, Bicol and then, is it takeout? 
dine in. Dine in. Oh. Yeah. Thanks. And some rice. Rice. Thank you. So, how about rice? One cup? Yes. Can I have rice, please? <laughs> Great place. It's pretty hot today. And that's not on. It is now. And for a service water, you need a peso. <laughs> One peso of water. Thank you very much. 110 pesos. Bicol Express. Straight on. Shop Sui. Straight on top of that. So we get some vegetables. Bicol Express is really nice. It's quite spicy. Finished. Delicious and healthy. Heading now to the boulevard for coffee. I quite often go to DM's music studio too for coffee, but they're not open. So we're down on the boulevard now. And you can see that all the, uh, the food vendors uh, have left their tents set up because the Pug Salabok Festival is going for another week, I think. Another week of the Pug Salabok Festival. Uh, but we're heading to Better Brews, which is just here. Well, I'm all set up outside with a coffee and that's the view but uh, I'll give you a look at what the view uh, is normally like it's normally a sensational view all right that's brunch coffee and uh, it's pretty hot. I think it's time to wend my way back to the Happy Tell. What a great place to stay. Happy Tell. Back to the Happy Tell for a snooze, for a siesta. Actually, just before we do, I've got to show you something. The view from the boulevard is absolutely sensational. Just have a look at this. And the mountains over there. Oh, it's so beautiful. 